Over the past 20 years, I think we've done a pretty good job of educating the public around the risk factors for heart disease. We know that we need to have our cholesterol checked probably once a year, we should have our blood pressure checked regularly, we should be screened for diabetes, we should stop smoking, we should get off the couch and exercise regularly. All of those things are, are things that contribute to our heart disease risk and by modifying them or monitoring them, we'll be aware of what our numbers are and what our heart disease risk is. One risk factor for heart disease that's been sort of overlooked, I think, over the years is the effect of stress on our bodies and the effect that stress can have on our heart disease risk. What is stress? Every, everyday life brings stress. Getting out of bed can be stress in the morning, uh, preparing for a seminar, giving a presentation, uh, just being at work can be stressful for some folks. Stress in and of itself isn't necessarily a bad thing. Stress helps motivate us and helps us get things done. When stress becomes distress or bad stress, uh, it, can be, it can have negative effects on us. They can affect our cholesterol levels, our blood pressure, our blood sugar, all of those things that we know have a significant impact on our heart disease risk. By taking the time to identify distress or bad stress in your life and finding effective ways to manage it, which may be through exercise, it may be through counseling, uh, you'll allow yourself to further reduce a risk factor for heart disease and live a longer, healthier life.